Nature's best, Bobtail. It's Expresso on SABC3, and today we have with us once again our animal behaviorist, Karis Bryan. How are you, Karis? I'm good, Leanne. Thanks. So today we're talking about the issue of fearful dogs and how to help overcome that. Mm -hmm. Can you tell us more? Absolutely. Yeah. So I'm going to introduce first Savannah, Yay! who's helping us out today. Hello, now, Savannah Savannah. is not a very fearful dog at all. She's mm. a very well-trained, she's one of yeah. my acting dogs. And I've brought her in with me just as an example dog today. Okay. So let's pretend that Savannah is a very scared dog. And we've all had that experience yes, of a dog yes. that's backing up and barking and unsure of people. Yeah. The mistake people usually make is in the way that they try to make that dog feel comfortable. So if we pretend Savannah is a scared dog, the worst thing for me to do, which people normally try, yes. is to lean over and mm. try to touch her on the head. Now look at this from her perspective. Yes. I'm looming over on top of her. I'm staring at her with my eyes. It's quite intimidating. It's very okay? intimidating. Yeah. It's the wrong thing to do. Mm. When you want to make a dog feel comfortable, the best thing for you to do is turn your shoulders and your hips away from the dog. Okay. That takes a lot of pressure off of them. Yeah. And then not to stare at the dog, but rather look at the ground. Wow. Right. Now, if a dog is close to you, but like a little bit unsure, not quite sure what yeah. to do, if you get a little bit of food, a little yeah. bit of a treat, and offer it without looking at the dog, but look at the ground, and come down like this without leaning over the dog. Wow. That's a way to help a feel for dog feel comfortable. Comfortable, with you. yeah, you're right. And if a dog is tall, you can feed him standing up. Okay. Okay, so deflect away and crouch down. Yes. Now for kids, this is Mika who's hey, helping Mika. us out today. <laughs> Savannah, sit. Come, sit, 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 sit. Wake up. Savannah's so chilled she's falling asleep on the seat. <laughs> Come, I love Savannah. Her I know, she's gorgeous. Sit. Okay. There now, sit. Sit. Now, from Savannah's perspective, Mika's eyes are almost making eye contact with yeah. her. Stay. So when there's kids meeting dogs, let's do the same thing. Mika, come here with me. What you want to do is actually turn the kids, she's trying to do a high five, <laughs> away from the dog, and then give the kid a little treat, and then just feed her without looking at her, oh, like that. Oh, wow. And so again, his shoulders have turned away. There's yes. a happy association of okay. the food coming in, okay. but there's no eye contact and no staring, yes. and certainly no hugging. Yeah. You must always tell children, don't hug the dog, yeah, yeah. because again, you're going on top of that's them. That's right, that's right. And that's the first thing that kids usually do, hey, is they Absolutely. try to, they they try to embrace like, uh, like humans would embrace kids as right. well, hey? Right, exactly. And I going see. over the top makes a dog feel a little bit more intimidating. Yeah, yeah. So no eye contact, no hugging, rather turn away. And if a dog is genuinely fearful, yeah. go with the dog's own pace. Mm. There's no reason that you should actually have to touch and engage with the dog. Yeah. Allow them to come to you. And if you, if without making that eye contact, the dog yeah. will feel comfortable a lot quicker to come to and you. And of course, it's like you said, it's all about consistency mm -hmm. as well. If you consistently do the same things over and Absolutely. over. Wow, yes. wonderful. Thank you so much, Karis. It's always great talking to you. Cool. And if you would like more information on what we've just talked about with Karis right now, you can go to www.happydogs.com co.za or go to our Expresso Facebook page, Expresso Morning Show, SABC3, and we'll see you again next week, Harris. Thank oh, you. Thanks, thanks so much. Stay with Expresso and SABC3.